Hey guys, I hope you're having a great weekend so far. I just wanted to take a quick minute and give you a book recommendation, and it's related to this book, which was featured in my Instagram today. This is The Fire Child by S.K. Tremaine, and it comes out in March. So if you saw my Instagram post today, in my post, I mentioned this author's first thriller, which is The Ice Twins, and this book is one of my most recommended. I totally love it, and tonight I'm going to tell you why. So just to back up for a minute, I know that The Fire Child has received some mixed reviews, but I wanted to check it out so badly because of how much I enjoyed The Ice Twins. So more on this book to come. I just started it today and I'm excited to see where it goes. I will keep you guys updated if it belongs on your reading list. But now let's get back to The Ice Twins. I always feel like there's a time and place for a book that's just plain entertaining. It doesn't have to be super serious or super heavy or dark. It's just a book that you totally get hooked on and it's chilling and addictive. The Ice Twins is that book. The Ice Twins is a psychological thriller and it follows a perfect family. They have two adorable young twin daughters, but one day tragedy strikes and one of the daughters dies in an accident. To keep things simple, let's call the daughters A and B. So daughter A has died and the family decides they're gonna move to this really remote Scottish island where they can try to heal and if it's possible, move past this horrible accident. But when they get to the island, things start to get strange. The house feels really eerie to the wife and to make matters worse, daughter B, the surviving daughter, starts to claim that she's actually daughter A and that daughter B was the one who died in the accident. Not only is their surviving daughter making these crazy claims, but her behavior is also getting really erratic and kind of disturbing. And when the husband has to go away for a business trip and a storm encroaches on the island, things get creepy really fast. I loved this book. Like I said before, this is not super serious crime fiction. It's not very heavy. It's not very violent. I just found it super atmospheric and totally addictive. But you should note, this book isn't like super fast-paced or action-packed. It's more of a slow build. I really felt like the atmosphere of the small island was just perfect. It really provided a whole backdrop, a whole world for this story that I loved. So if you're in the mood for a mystery that's slow-burning, very atmospheric, and that almost has a ghostly quality to it, I definitely recommend The Ice Twins. I totally enjoyed this book. It really creeped me out, actually, even though it's not super dark. I just started The Fire Child today, and I'm really excited to find out if it compares to The Ice Twins for me. I know there have been mixed reviews of this one, but I really enjoyed The Ice Twins, and I just had to see for myself what The Fire Child is like.